I'm Antonio Centeno, the founder of Real Men Real Style, and today I'm going to be answering the question, can an off-the-rack suit be altered to fit as good as a custom suit? All right. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. By doing so, these videos come right to you. In addition, uh, if you like this video, go ahead and click on the like button. That helps me understand which direction to take these videos and this channel in general. And finally, if you uh, want to learn more, if you enjoy what you read or listen to here and you want to read about it, then go to the article I linked to right down here, useful articles. I always send you to something that has great solid content. Okay. This is the question that came in. Dear Antonio, I love your website. Thank you. But I can't afford your clothing. Can I take an off the rack suit that has been altered to fit and will it fit the same as a custom suit? Thank you. All right. Very, very much to the point. He doesn't have the money to buy custom clothing, but he wants a custom fit. So can he get it with an off the rack suit? I mean, is, is it possible? The short answer is yes, it is possible. As, you know, and, I, and this is coming from a custom clothier. What you really buy when you buy custom clothing, besides being able to get whatever you want and being able to choose from any fabric, is really a speed. Because there is probably a suit out there that could fit you perfectly. But who knows where it is and do you have the time to go out there and find it? And for some men, it's going to be much harder to fit. So I'm going to break this question down into five parts. And these are the five things, if you're short on funds and you really need a good suit, that you should be asking yourself if you're going to be making the decision between a custom suit or going with an off the rack. And this is, this is all focused on fit right here. So the first thing is how close of a fit can you get off the rack? So you need to go out there and look and try on a number of suits. And if you can find something that, wow, this thing fits really well, th then go for it. I, I mean, there are men out there who can go out there and find certain brands, especially if you're looking towards European brands and if you're in good shape, you'll find that those are made for less people. The problem with most clothing is that it is made to fit tons. I mean, it, it's made to fit a hundred different body types. And because it's made to fit so many body types, it doesn't fit any of them well. So this is when you go, and again, I don't want to bash any warehouses or Jose Banks, you know, they fit a purpose, but the, the clothing you find there for the most part is going to be too big on most men who try it on simply because it's made to fit a lot more men. Then if you go in and you try in like a Xenia, but if you're looking at Xenia, then you might as well be looking at custom because we're talking two to $4,000 suits, but Xenia suits, those are made for a very specific type of profile. If you're a portly man, you are not going to be able to wear a Xenia suit. And Xenia makes it that way because they only want a certain type of body type in their suits. So if you can find a brand, go for it. And, and that you may be able to find a fit that would fit you just as well as custom. The next thing you're going to want to look at is how well put together the suit is. So this is another thing that you buy when you get custom is that you get to choose the fabric and you know that since this is being made by hand, the construction is going to be most likely really good. You know, when it comes, I mean, if you look at my, my shoulder pads here, these are hand packed with, with cotton. Now, if there's a lot of jackets out there that they use foam and you just will never be able to get the same type of fit, the same type of drape that you get by using quality materials. So that is something that you need to be looking for in that off the rack jacket. And understand that it may initially fit good, but if it's not made from good quality materials, that great fit is not necessarily going to last over time. So that was number two, make sure it's well put together. Uh, number three, the alterations, specifically what needs to be altered. So if you can find something off the rack that fits you overall pretty well, but it's just a bit tight in the shoulders, you need to move on because you're not going to be able to, to bring out those shoulders. However, if it's just a bit small, you can have, and if it's made of a good quality, you know, from a good quality company, let's say you find this in a thrift store, you can, and, and it would pay possibly to have those shoulders brought in. Now, this is like reconstructive heart surgery here for tailors, but that takes me to part four. Because if you've got a good quality jacket and the alterations, whether they be small or big, it really comes down to the tailor. And can you take it to a man who, or, or a woman, 
who is used to working with jackets and can, in a sense, work miracles. So the shoulder I talked about, that's going to cost you a lot of money. We're talking well over $100. But if you've got a jacket that overall fits you pretty well, but it just needs to be brought in or loosened up in the midsection, that's a pretty easy alteration and something that you can have done Gosh, I can have it done here in, in Wausau, Wisconsin. I, I mean, it isn't hard to find somebody. And so the skill of the tailor, though, if you want a major alteration done, you're going to have to find somebody that can actually almost build jackets. And, and it, that, that's really what you need. In that case, you know, again, if you find a thrift store, a great jacket that just maybe needs those shoulders altered, well, maybe it's worth spending $150 to get that work done and it may turn out beautifully. But again, you're going to want to make sure you've got a skilled tailor. So that was the fourth one. Uh, number five, you need to know what you want because fit is very personal and you may want something close fitting. You may want something loose fitting. Whatever you want, make sure you get it. Okay. This has been Antonio Centeno with Real Men Real Style. Hope that helped answer the question and best of luck to you. Take care.